Oh, interesting. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Hello, ladies. Well, hello. Now back to oh, Catherine. Back to your man. Now back to me. I Sadly, him. <laughs> but if he stopped using lady scented body wash and switched to Old Spice, he could smell like he's me. Look down. Back up. Where are her you? eyes? Actually, bugged out. Here, a, a male pornography here. What's in your hand? Back at me. I have it. It's an uh, Robert's a little Two jealous. I can see thing. that. You love. Look again. <laughs> the tickets are now diamond. Anything is possible when your man smells like Old Spice and not a lady. I'm on a horse. <laughs> da, 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 da. And the ship that crossed the ocean. Hello, ladies. How well, are hello you? Hello again. Does wow. Man look like Still me? jealous. Can he smell like me? Yes. Should he use Old Spice body? The man of my dream. Know. Do you like the smell of adventure? Oh, Do you want again. a man who smells like he can Oh, he's walking on water. That's quite biblical, isn't it? He's like hardcore. Swan dive into the best <laughs> night of your life. That takes some creativity. Like <laughs> the guy's great. Wow. <laughs> you tell me. I like her reactions. <laughs> he wants more. Sort of leaves you speechless, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, this is going to be good. How would you describe these commercials to somebody? I don't remember them that, that well. Wow. Uh, very upbeat. Very contemporary. Nice. Very funny. Yeah. Those are out Thank there. you. The first one we've seen so many times. He was on a horse. Look, he's tired of it. He doesn't want it. Robert Owens wants to have nothing to do with that guy on the horse. Why did they choose to make outlandish commercials to sell products? I think they did it just so you would remember the product name. Television has become commercial. Mm -hmm. Interrupted You're right. Program. You're right. To get attention. And you'll remember it, supposedly, when you go to the store. You go, oh, I remember that. That mm -hmm. was funny. And you buy Advertising it. 101. I just think they're so clever and fun and brilliant. At last, an honest assessment. I actually have an old Old Spice commercial to show you. Wonderful. I'm excited. <laughs> Wake up with Old Spice. Feel the spray on your face. I remember that bottle. I remember that. Robert bottle. smiled Come on, at the old commercial. The of the open sea with Old Spice. And yet, he scoffed at mine. The modern one, you have a guy that you can't look like, because that guy's got it all. He's not somebody that you're going to be. I don't have it all. You might be on uh, ship I'd like to have it all, though. They have tens of millions of views. <laughs> Some people will watch anything. Just goes to show you how far we've degenerated. <laughs> wow. There is a viral... The commercial's product. degenerative? Do you ever think that one day the commercials would become the entertainment? No. No. Never. But, th but they really, a lot of them really are like little baby movies. I like that he said they're like little baby movies. Kind of makes them feel cute. <laughs> so what did you think of the other's opinions? You know, the, the women... Uh, since the commercial was geared toward women, had had the, the appropriate uh, reaction that I think the advertisers were looking for. The men had mixed reactions. Some of them seemed pretty like cool with it, like, oh, that's cool, that's interesting the way they did it. Um, others seemed a little uh, less interested. Robert seemed like he was a little bit jealous. Let's just be honest. I think Robert sees himself as the Old Spice guy. And he's like, you know, why didn't they ask me to do that commercial? I could have done that. Do you have any memories of what you thought when you heard the pitch for this commercial? The first time I read the copy was just at the audition, and I, I, or when I got it, and I, I was like, oh, this is kind of crazy. The first time I saw the finished product was an ADR. I laughed at like, every time I saw it because it was just ridiculous. Every time I would say, uh, the tickets are now diamond. Like, Pete, like the Carlos was in this dude, Carlos was in the booth, and he, <laughs> he would literally fall out of his chair laughing. And so that would make me laugh. Did these commercials help or hurt your career? Oh, they definitely helped, yeah. I don't know if I'd be sitting here if they, if they uh, those commercials hadn't, uh, hadn't done what they did. So back during that campaign, I remember that you made dozens and dozens of custom YouTube response videos to user submitted questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did that three different times. Uh, but the first time was by far the funnest and, and most uh, amazing three days I've ever had filming anything. The group was turning around videos every seven minutes. At the time, it was pretty interesting. You would take video responses from, or video uh, YouTube questions, Twitter questions, and then they would go to writers. They would write up a script with, within like, you know, five minutes or whatever. I mean, they were really witty too. And they'd throw it to me in front of a monitor. I would say it one time just so they could hear the tone of it. And they would be like, okay, go. And then the next time I'd say it, I would look in the camera and then and, and deliver it. And there's, there's tons of, like we did a uh, hundred and, 177, 186, I, I forget the number now. And how do you feel about Old Spice being a part of your legacy? Oh man, I, I, I genuinely have come to absolutely love it. I get a kick out of it because if my daughter ever goes into advertising or marketing, 
uh, I, will, I will be in one of her textbooks as a, as a case study because I get tweets and, and uh, messages all the time and people go like, oh, I was reading my book and then I saw you and then I saw this thing about your Old Spice campaign. It was like, you know, so it's, it's kind of fun and, and cool. Mm -hmm.